We once thought that the earth was flat and that if we walked far enough in one direction, we would fall off. Then we realized the earth was round and that we couldn't fall off. This led to global exploration and an explosion in learning and discovery. At this moment in time, I believe we are on the cusp of a flat earth to round earth transformation in the sciences. You can be a part of this transformation and help make it happen. My name is Cameron Mercer. I have a great passion for learning and discovery. Going through public school did not encourage this great passion of mine. I was really into physics. You know what was exciting? The idea that things were not finished, not complete, that I could have a future in physics. But the feeling I got from public school was that everything was already known, and all I had to do was learn it by rote. I thought, if we already know everything, what incentive do I have for pursuing physics? No opportunity for discovery, nor for making a contribution. Black holes, dark matter, dark energy, neutron stars, a nuclear fusion-powered sun, comets that are dirty snowballs. These are theories we have created to explain phenomena we observe in the heavens. They represent hypothetical processes that do not actually exist on Earth, nor have these processes ever been successfully reproduced in a lab. We can create nuclear fusion, but not the supposed sustained nuclear fusion of the sun. Each of these theories is unique and requires its own set of criteria. This has sometimes led to contradictions, mutual exclusion, and the rewriting of the laws of physics. All these theories are based on the idea that gravity is the predominant force in the universe. And yet, we know that electricity is anywhere from 27 to 40 orders of magnitude more powerful than gravity. Billions and billions of times more powerful. Even as a high school student, something about these theories truly bothered me. So much has been built on an assumption that can now be seen as an error. And yet the theories remain and are presented as virtual fact in my school books. University seemed like an extension of high school, another set of well-established givens that I would have to memorize by rote. No discovery involved. But I love learning and discovery. So I kept reading and researching, and I discovered this fascinating new alternative to what I had learned in school. This alternative seemed to make infinitely more sense and opened the door to amazing new possibilities. The Electric Universe is a unified theory that proposes different explanations for these phenomena. Black holes, dark matter, dark energy, neutron stars, the features of the sun and the comet can all be explained in terms of the known properties and actions of electricity. Similar electrical processes exist on planet Earth and have been reproduced countless times in laboratories. The Electric Universe is the culmination of the ideas of a number of exceptionally gifted scientists at work over the last century and a half. Ideas that are now being synthesized and refined by a small group working today. The principal creators of this theory are alive and well. Right now their research is accelerating exponentially as they are joined by scientists and scholars from many different disciplines. Astronomy, physics, astro and plasma physics, chemistry, biology, geology, meteorology, even archaeology, all the scientific disciplines are being informed and enhanced by this new theory. In January of 2013, the Electric Universe will hold its next conference. The scholarship program will bring eight successful applicants to the conference. Here they will meet the principal proponents of the Electric Universe theory. They will rub shoulders with the accomplished scientists and scholars who are researching and forwarding these ideas. I find this fascinating. Imagine, you're a high school graduate, you haven't yet entered university, and yet you can go to this conference and be participating in the future of science with the very individuals who are creating it. It's like being able to hang out with the Galileo and Copernicus of your time. This past summer, I was a scholarship invitee. I came out of nowhere with no credentials and sat down at the same dinner table with David Talbot and Wal Thornhill in the Electric Universe group. I had one-on-one -on -one conversations with him and was treated as an equal. 
when I offered my own ideas, I was listened to. Black holes, dark matter, dark energy, neutron stars, the nuclear fusion sun, comets as dirty snowballs, are all separate theories generated from the current gravitational model. The electric universe model can explain these and many other phenomena in a single unified theory, a theory so simple and logical it can be grasped by elementary school children. We will be the next generation of scientists who put the truth above all things. Check that to you, sir. Karen Mercer. I am convinced the Electric Universe will have a profound effect on all the sciences. For me personally, it opens the door up to learning, to discovery, and to participating in the evolution of human knowledge. This pitch to you is not actually a pitch. It is an invitation. Flat Earth, Round Earth. I invite you to help support this modest scholarship fund. I believe that by doing so, we'll be playing a crucial role in a huge transformational jump in our understanding of the universe and how it works. Thank you.